Hi everyone, Singing Sarah here from Sunflower Music. Today I'm going to do a mystery tune. This is something that I do uh, pretty frequently in my groups and story times and classes, and it's also something I encourage parents to try at home. It's a really great focus listening activity, and you don't need a glockenspiel to make it happen. You can just hum or whistle a melody and see if your child can guess what it is. So. I am going to play it on a glockenspiel, though. So, first I'll play the song, and you guys see if you can guess what it is. sing it together. Ready? The itsy bitsy spider went up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Out came the sun and dried up all the rain. And the itsy bitsy spider went up the spout again. Now some of you have met the, the itsy bitsy spider's big brother. But if you haven't, you're in for a treat. It's the great big spider. And he sings with a big, low voice. So we're going to sing it with a big, low voice. Ready? The great big spider went up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Out came the sun and dried up all the rain, and the great big spider went up the spout again. <laughs> and now, the itsy bitsy and the great, great big, I'm sorry, the great big spider want to introduce their baby sister. Very nice. Changing up our voices is not just fun and silly, but it also works on developing our range so that when we're singing more songs later on, we can we can sing a greater variety of songs. So hope you'll try that, not just with Itsy Bitsy, but with some other songs. I'll see you guys later. Bye. 